mental clutter. So here's a picture of my brain, actually. Uh, maybe I showed a bit like this. What you can see here is my high beta. High beta are certain frequencies in the brain and they are associated with high stress. And what I've done in the past year is I've just decluttered my life. And, and part of that reasoning is I wanted to reduce my high beta because um, high beta is when you're stressed, you're busy, maybe you can't sleep well at night anymore, you're constantly worried, you have like that feeling of being suffocated and overwhelmed with all the stress in your life. And I have taken the approach to actively tackle all five sources of clutter. And what you can see here in the pre, you see the, the high beta was kind of red, which means there was too much. And afterwards, it's in the green blue area, which is when it's optimal. So I've actually um, taken a huge step uh, towards reducing my personal high beta and getting into alpha more often, which is associated with a high inside and relaxed um, focused attention. So I just wanted to share this with you. So that would be the goal when you reduce your mental clutter.